Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 22 here on the Western Wilds. That's right folks, we are in oh, hang on. I got Whoa! There, I set crows there. We are in our 9RX. 9RX 640 series. I think 640 horsepower. Um yeah, this this is our tractor and this is a demo roller. We did not buy it. And the roller is uh Mandago. Yeah, it's a pretty nice roller here. Uh ah, dusty back here. See all the roller wheels are up and stuff. It's pretty neat. Out, out, uh, pretty neat thing. Yeah, I'll get it out in a minute. But anyway, it's your host with not the most, Mr. Blue, K.A. Uh, A.K.A. Tommy Miller, folks. I hope y'all are doing good. I hope y'all are doing really, really good. We got our planter over there. We're fixing plant some oats as soon as we get done rolling here. I could put this guy on a roller, but the telephone poles across the end here. Yeah, he he don't like telephone poles, so I'm doing it myself. Right. Anyway, uh, how y'all doing today? I think I didn't ask that, didn't I? Uh, folks, we can't get the the silo that we want, and uh, yeah, I I kind of got a letter in the mail. I don't have it with me, but uh, we, we're going to have to move. Uh, I've been wanting a, uh, you know, idea to shutting down this series anyway because uh, the productions and stuff on there. Oh, I think I just made a boo-boo back up. I was supposed to turn. I was supposed to turn. I guess I don't like the telephone poles either. <laughs> anyway, lock that back on. Hit her cruise speed here and uh yeah the there's several things that i don't know what i done it's not the map maker any, any problems with him it, it's this i've done oh ellie and jim done a wonderful job with this map uh but something's not right with one of the mods interfering with the animals where you know i can't feed them and stuff so, uh, yeah, uh, Mr. Big Daddy one, uh, go back a couple of episodes and, uh, I was feeding the sheeps and stuff and, and they, they, I just couldn't feed them. Now the chickens are doing pretty good, I guess. Um, I'm going to hire a worker real quick to take this over and we're going to bob around here. Um, yeah, well, we need to get that guy going, but not quite yet. I'm wanting, um, probably as close as I can get. Let's see, I think this door up here is open. Oh, nope, oh, window. We're going to run down here. We need to check. Let's see, get one, or no, oh, or not even a quarter pallet of honey. I guess, uh, during the winter time they don't produce as much I guess that would be right because they should start producing here soon our cotton is up and the cotton picker that I wanted is finally fixing to be released here in hopefully a couple more days uh, yeah we got this pallet right here that started and it's doing pretty good and we have this pallet here which is about the same. So if it don't produce another one here soon, um, there's something wrong with this thing. So yeah. I uh, see here we're at 51 chickens, and we can go to 5,000. Whoa, that is awesome. Oh oh oh! Did you? Oh look at it. he's got it raised. Last time I thought it fold. Oh wow! 
Well, that's working right, because last time it just wanted to uh, fold back up. Or was that one on... No, I'll take it back. That was one on the... Uh, oh... I can't even think of what it's called. I just... Nah. Not Pacific Northwest. I don't know why that's doing my name in my brain. I don't know... Uh, Silver Run Force. There we go. Silver Run Force. Uh, that roller on there, it folds up. So we'll have to change rollers to this and the Mandago is pretty awesome. Um, trying to think if there's anything else. Hire a worker. Maybe I'll keep going. Okay, there it goes. We're going to go in here. And this right here, the field calculator would calculate. But it's on CP1 and CP2. That's course play layouts I had. I don't know why it's doing that. But it would calculate it. But you can see right here, this is the course play thing I was trying to do. But it needs to be redone. Um, yeah, if we go into... The, the score, you know, 41 is pretty low. 56, 63, 44, 41. These are going to probably hurt us because there's no formable land in there, but it's still showing its land. We got 40, 26. Those are hurting us because they're below. So that's why we're at 51. But hopefully after this harvest, all that be brought up. Ah! Worker! What are you done? No! I don't want you. Oh my god. Stop. Stop, stop, stop. Alright. I guess we're where we need to be. We're gonna hold our potatoes right here. Go ahead and shut this big boy off. And we're gonna get in our 8 or X. Right, let's get in here and get her warmed up. And cab cooled off. I like my cab cold. Um, yeah, everything looks good back there. A couple of seconds here while we're doing that. We're going to go back down here to this screen. As you can see, everything that's white is cotton. Everything that is yellowish or kind of a gold looking color. Um, this color. Yeah, that color. That's corn. And the green is soybeans. And then this field here is going to be oats. Let's double check that real quick. Um, yeah, right in here. Um, for some reason, I don't have my mouse. No mouse. I can scroll with it, but I don't have a pointer. But anyway, uh, as you can see, over the September and October, we can plant wheat and barley and uh, canola over that way. But right here, only thing in March, April, we can plant is oats, corn, soybeans, sunflower, stuff like that. So we're going to plant oats because we can harvest them in July and August. And then turn around plant uh, canola or we can plant wheat and barley. Which I don't know what the chickens, let's see what oats will do for us. Um, chicken like wheat, barley, and sorghum. Okay, so there's, there's uh, wheat, barley, and sorghum. I know we can't do uh, wheat and barley. Let's check on the sorghum. Okay, yeah. We're going to do soy gum now, and we're going to harvest it probably August, and then be able to plant. Okay, so we're going to do soy gum instead. That'd be for the chickens. Alright, let's see here. We need to set the oats. We're going to do soy gum. Good, we can do it with this. Alright, we're going to turn, turn it on. We still got some fertilizer left and some seeds left. Let's hope it's enough to get this field done. We're going to do across the ends here first. I don't like doing it that way. But, you know, hey. 
all this tractor may not pull this th oh my god the 8 or x is not going to pull it we're doing one mile an hour folks alright well uh, um okay let's turn it off raise it up let's go ahead and detach it <clears throat> that kind of burns me up A or X won't pull it alright well we got a little bit to row it's shown we don't have to row behind the sorghum. Let's park this here. Go ahead and shut it off. Nobody's going to be going down that road anytime soon. Let's go ahead and unhook the roller. Okay. We got to hook, well, this tractor, the cedar, or yeah, this big planter behind us. Uh, it's not ours. We're just demo, demo and something about 10,000 for the demo. I don't know. It's per thing or what? Let's see here. Turn on. Uh, turn it off for a second. Sorghum. Yeah, we're still on Sorghum. Oh, yeah. ARX got plenty of power. Go ahead and We are using fertilizer. I see it's going down, but those seeds are going down even more. Oh boy. And we'll make it without going into the water. There we go. Raise that up. kind of hard to turn this thing and it looks like we're going to have to oh don't turn too short I'm going to go ahead and uh, let it down there um, trying to get the GPS thing to line up and it's not wanting to that would be going the wrong way. We'll get it right there on the edge. Oop, about like that right there. Connect and go. All right. Everything looking good. Yep, still looking good, still. Let's check over here on this side. Oh yeah, yeah, looking good. Temp and everything running good. I'll turn on some music here and uh, just sit back and relax. Let's see how much it's gonna. Let's go in here real quick and look at our field data. Let me this in here. It's not changing oxygen. Uh, not nitrogen I mean very much it is putting out not very much but it's we're gonna need some seed but uh I'm gonna do a jump cut here folks I'm gonna go across the end up there down by the poles or I might just go this way to the poles and see how that's gonna work out well, I got the GPS thing here so I'll know exactly where I need to be over there but uh, I'll bring you back when I get almost done all right folks it looks like uh it's gonna be the last through because you can see right here how close it is to the power line poles you can see right there I could plant a little bit more but then I could be double planting here well, not really. In real life, we would, but in game, it wouldn't. 
So yeah, that looks pretty good down through there. So yeah, I'm going to leave it at that. I wish there was a way we could uh, get a hold enough fill to. I don't know if I got time to show you or not. Maybe we do. I was looking at the chickens again and stuff and it hasn't registered that we have eggs at all. It's showing zero. So I don't know. I know this reproduction line is gray and it used to be red. So, don't know about that either. Um, boy, I wish we had the, the man right now, 109,000 liters of wheat. Well, we didn't plant no wheat. Is there any sorghum? No, no, no sorghum. Um, yeah, I, I guess uh, I'm going to go ahead and call it quits here. Uh, cause there ain't no sense in that little bit right there. Because the header's going to need room go around the poles and stuff we'll probably be leaving it anyway so yeah um, so I'm gonna say that's it folks uh, go ahead and throw this bad boy up get over here in the grass that goes all the things folding up and wings should be folding yep well, I'm gonna take a a thumbnail right about there somewhere in there it probably shows it on that end but yeah we're done planting soy grum I was gonna plant wheat but no uh, and uh, I gotta get back to the shop get the seed and fertilize emptied out of this because it's all ours and all our fields are planted Every single one of them. I'm going to use a GPS. Why not, right? Oh, yeah, I love this setup. If we don't keep it, I just don't see how we're going to afford the payments on it myself because we are in a hole. Get on down here. Oh, let's back up this way. 3500000 I think what we're going to do, we're, we're going to get the thing planted. I mean, planted. We're going to get this loan paid off. And um, we're going to get the crops out. And we're going to be moving to a new place. Uh, I was going to tell you that earlier about the letter, uh, which I didn't get into details. But the letter is pretty much um, uh, my cousin was doing a farm and you know he didn't get started very much but he became ill and and uh, we're just going to say I hate doing this I really do hate doing this but we're just going to say he passed away and we're going to go take over his farm on a different map so basically we're going to be inheriting the farm oh I gotta watch out for these holes don't want to drive around out here because they got some stuff piled up there that's going to do that and but the packers in the shed out of the rain and stuff and they're supposed to be back on vacation but I'm just going to tell them don't worry about it come get their equipment and stuff and uh, yeah we're, we're we're not going to be long around long enough to do a uh, didn't want to pull up that far, but that should be straight right there. Uh, actually, I'm just going to pull it over here to the pressure washer. We're going to wash it off for John at the dealership. And we're going, well, we're going to uh, get this stuff out somehow or another. But anyway, folks, that, that's going to be it. We're going to shoot this bad boy off. So basically, we're going to be selling off, but we're going to get all the crops out all the crops out we got a telephone call be right back ah they wanted me to vote or not a vote but a survey for voters uh, i can vote but i told him no but anyway back to this um 
all this pretty fence we put in and stuff I hate for it to go to waste but I guess uh, when we come back in the next episode I'm on the rock picker and stuff like that will probably be selling off uh, we might keep the bagger. We might put the stuff in a in a bag and wait till it does get a better price. Don't quite know yet. We're just gonna have to see how things go. The mower we're gonna need. Uh, I guess it mulches. It says more mul fire mower mulcher. So that shouldn't mulch up the uh, the short grown stalks. But anyway. We're going to be selling off some stuff in the next episode. The cotton stripper, hopefully the new one is out. And I'm just going to replace this one with the new one so y'all can see it. It's it's basically the same thing. This a header looks smaller. And does this detach? Um, it don't show it detaches. No. The other one is a detachable head and it's got tracks on it, folks. So when we go to our new map, we'll probably be getting one of them. But we will be starting off small. Um, our factories, we're just going to let them go out. Um, I got to run this over here to this sudden. Uh, we're just gonna let them, you know, fast forward time and stuff, let them run out, and we'll sell the profit and stuff. Uh, we gotta stay here until uh, everything is sold, so the next episode, that's what it will be about. Hopefully a, bit, a little bit more. Hopefully this didn't park over it. Should be this one here. Uh, this one's got 27,119 out of 100,000, so we're quarter away, uh, only got a quarter in it. Um, too bad that didn't do. But folks, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it here. Uh, when we come back, we will be selling some things off, uh, and running our factories till they get dry and all that stuff. And, and but anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed it, and I hope y'all looking forward to the new map. I'll hopefully have more uh information about it and the new or not not new the next episode that's what i was trying to say in the next episode i have more about the new map there i got it out right that time so until then we'll be uh watching the plants grow but folks i hope y'all enjoyed it i love each and every one of y'all y'all have a great day a blessed day I will see y'all later. Bye.